Hello everyone, in this video, we are solve an interesting math x squared is equal to 2 to the power x. What is the value of x in this exponential equation? So first of all, if you think x is equal to 2, you can see easily 2 to the power 2, 2 to the power 2, both are same. So I can say x is equal to 2 is our right answer. So if you think x is equal to 4, so you can see easily 4 is squared 2 to the power 4, so 16 is equal to 16. It is also our right answer. So we need the whole value, all below the x in this exponential equation. So how to solve this equation? First of all, I use both sides natural log ln x squared is equal to ln 2 to the power x. Then I just move on this exponent in front so I can see it will be 2 ln x is equal to and here is x it will be x ln 2 then I move on this x this side so I can see it will be ln x over this x is equal to ln 2 over this 2 then I can see easily it will be the exponential rules this x it will be x to the power minus 1 and here is ln x is equal to half this 2 here is ln 2 then I can say here is x to the power minus 1 ln x is equal to ln 2 to the power this half I just move on this half here is exponent so I can say it will be x to the power minus 1 ln x is equal to ln square root 2 we know that to the power half it will be square root 2 now what can i do so in this case i can say here is x so it will be positive or negative so first case i can say this x greater than zero and other case i can say easily this x less than zero now I can say easily in this case x to the power minus 1 I mean x in bars ln this x is equal to ln square root 2 then look in this case I can say here is x to the power minus 1 we know that it will be power ln a is equal to a according to this rules I can say here is e to the power ln this x and I use here is minus look this minus it will be minus 1 so if I move on this minus 1 in exponent so I can say it will be e to the power and then ln x inverse so you know that e to the power ln a it will be a so x inverse it will be e to the power minus ln x and this ln x I use this side is equal to ln square root 2 then I use both side minus so I can say here is minus this is minus and in this case I use the Lambert W function so I can say here is W minus ln x e to the power minus ln x is equal to W minus ln square root 2 we know that the Lambert function w minus ln x e to the power minus ln x according to these rules I can see it will be minus ln x is equal to w minus ln square root 2. We know that w and this case are this case are equal and here is e this time where you use the w function. So in this case I can say here is x is equal to e to the power w minus ln square root 2 and this minus here is this is the value of x when x greater than 0 but others case x less than 0 I mean x is negative so what can I do so first of all I can say here is x inverse and ln in this case I can say x is minus ln square root 2 and this equation becomes e to the power 
elan in this case i can say easily i use bosec minus so i can say minus x whole to the power minus one so i can say easily to the power elan minus x and i use here is minus so minus x to the power minus one i can say easily to the power minus ln minus x and here is ln minus x this ln minus x and is equal to minus ln square root 2 and in this case i use both side lambert w function so i can say w ln minus x e to the power minus ln minus x is equal to here is ln square root 2 ln square root 2 this is minus so i use both side minus i can see easily it will be plus so here is minus because of that here is minus ln minus x so here is w then i can say here is minus ln according to lambert w function minus x is equal to w ln square root 2 then i can say here is x is equal to e to the power minus w ln square root 2 and here is minus this is minus so this is our other answer both are same just plus and here is minus so this is our final answer thank you all if you enjoy this video please subscribe my channel and like this video goodbye Take care.